Field. Welcome to the starting game of the new season of Pop Warner A, Reading Rockets, led by Coach Bob Geiger and Coach Dave Irwin. Your host here, Josh Blumenshine on Play by Play with Adam Hooker here on the camera. We're looking forward to a great game today as we play Chelsea here in the neutral location of Lexington, Mass for this uh, opening kickoff classic. So Reading uh, lost the coin toss to Chelsea. Chelsea deferred to the second half. Reading is going to receive going uh, from right to left on your, on your screen. This Chelsea squad comes here today with uh, two different colored jerseys, both red and black, which uh, leads to some uh, impressions of disorganization. But the Reading Rockets are ready to go. You're going to see their offense led by Brendan De Silva at quarterback. Uh, speed and a strong arm. Expect the Rockets to keep it on the ground primarily. Back deep right now we have Brendan De Silva number 10 as well as BJ Gemolaro number 7. Here's the kick. It's a good kick on a hop to BJ. He fields it at the 23. A little bit of disorganization. He's going backwards trying to loop past the defender. He's going to get brought down. No, he's still on his feet. Out past the 20. BJ's on the way. He gets all the way out to the 38-yard line. Well, a very dangerous kickoff return there by BJ. He made it work. Probably not what the coaches would have wanted. Redding breaks the line. They've got uh, receivers split out to right and left with just De Silva in the backfield. In motion, that's number 12, Dan McGrath. And the snap goes to BJ. He follows Dan's block over the right side on the first play from scrimmage. Picks up 13 yards down to the Chelsea 47. So Redding rotates in a new quarterback here. Uh, BJ Gemolaro, number seven. Here's the snap. He follows the block on the right side, number 22. He's going to get a couple yards on the play. That was Colin Duras. Redding uses the platoon for me, uh, situation here with the quarterback. So De Silva's back under under center here in the in the backfield. Second and eight. Dan McGrath motions. There's the snap. Brendan follows the block to the right side, breaks a tackle. The arm tackles by Chelsea here today. He's able to pick up the first down with a gain of eight on second down. Redding marching down the field here. First and 10 for the Reading Rockets now. Some of those linemen doing the, the dirty work here. Chris Chuley's down there. There's the snap to BJ. Makes a block, good block by 22. He evades a tackler. He's on his way. Arm, stiff arm, and he spins out of it down to about the 10 yard line. Reading gashing Chelsea for large chunks of yardage as they move down here for the first drive of the game. Here we go. Rockets ball, first and 10 from the 12 yard line. BJ and Colin Duras, I'm sorry, Brendan. He fakes the run, he throws. He's got the man for a touchdown, that's Dan McGrath. The little fake run and the throw. And Rockets are on the board first, 6 0. There was good protection there. No one back to cover that uh, that pass to Dan. Now what you're going to see from the Rockets, and, and just a reminder with Pop Warner, 
To kick the ball for an extra point is worth two. To run it in is worth one in Pop Warner. Most teams don't have an effective kicking game. This year the Rockets have a, a strong new kicker, Christian Trauger, number 43. And in practice he's been nearly flawless. So here we go with the holder, number 10, Brendan De Silva. For the extra point attempt, it's up and no good. Wide left. But that's all right, 6-0 Rockets as we get started here in the first, first quarter. Here we go, the Rockets prepare to kick off here to Chelsea for their initial drive of the game. Number 43, Christian Trauger gives a boot. It's a it's a uh, onside kick. It's at the picked up by the 35, 36. He's down to the 40 yard line where he's brought down by number 44 for the the Rockets. That's uh, Jason Conroy. Nice tackle there. And first and 10 for Chelsea at their own 40 yard line. There's the snap. He's going to throw. It's up deep. And there's an interference play. Number nine, Evan Long, did not get his head around. It's just like in college, they're going to call it every time. So there's a pass interference on Redding. Good arm by that quarterback for Chelsea. We had a little bit of, a little bit of pressure in the backfield from uh, number 54, Ben Mason. Didn't quite get there, though. So we had offsetting penalties there for that first play as Chelsea had too many men on the uh, on the field. So we're back at first and 10. Chelsea breaks the huddle. Receivers split out left and right. The throw goes to the side, a little lateral to number 66. He's brought down by BJ after a short gain of about a yard. Second and nine. Here we are, second and nine on the left hash. I'm noticing that the Chelsea center's not putting much on his snaps. Quarterback really has to delay. There's the snap. Brought down immediately by Dan McGrath, and uh, Brendan De Silva's there too. He does get two yards on the play. Brings up about third and six. After the Chelsea timeout, they come out with a third and five. Big play here for the Rockets to stop and get the ball back here. There's a snap, number 20, scrambles outside. We're there at number nine, a good tackle by Evan Long. Wraps him up, throws him out of bounds. So I bring up a fourth down, it's probably four down territory here. We'll see if they elect a punt. Here we go, Chelsea breaks the huddle, fourth and five. Two backs in the backfield with the quarterback. Comes up under center. There's the snap, the pitch to the left, he gets outside behind Duras. And the tackle by Jason Conroy, no, Dan McGrath drags him out of bounds at the 30 yard line. Nifty little play by Chelsea as they flipped it to the, uh, the pitch play. Running back got outside, first down. Normally does a first and ten from the 30 yard line. The snap for Chelsea. He pitches. Duras got a hand on it and caused a fumble. Looks like Chelsea's recovered at the 39, but that's a loss of nine yards on the play. Heads up play by Khan to get his hands on that. Redding on defense seeks to control the line of scrimmage with good A-gap, B-gap coverage. Right now we got Matt Gorman, number 23, and uh, also, uh, there he goes, number 20, he's going to the outside. He's brought down again for a loss of five on the play. Dan McGrath, and Chelsea's going backwards, 44-yard line. Some of those other guys on the line, uh, we've had, um, yeah, Thomas Keene was in there as well in the A-gap. Dom, Big Dom DiCrescenzo, number 32, B-gap. Ben Mason in the B-gap, number 54. 
Glad he can rotate guys in and out, but they, uh, they, they control the gap, so you can't run up the middle. You've got to go to the outside, which sets up the defensive ends and the linebackers to make the plays in this system. Third and very long for Chelsea. Everyone jumped on that one. It's going to be five yards on uh, Redding. Not only five yards on the penalty, but probably a couple burpee gassers from Coach. Third down and a little bit more manageable, about 19. There's the snap, number 20, pitches to the right. Rockets are all over it, ready for him. They bring him down at the 40. Number 12, Dan McGrath. Number 44, Jason Conroy. Fourth down and 18. Chelsea needs a bunch. Back deep is 10, Brandon De Silva. 22, Colin Ross. Number six gonna throw it up deep. At the high point, oh, it hit the receiver in the hands. He could not hold on. Coverage was there by Jason Conroy. But it'll be Redding's ball at the 40-yard line going the other direction. All right, as we start the second quarter, both teams have had one drive. Redding Rockets are up 6 nothing. We've got Christian Trauger split out wide right. There we go, the snap was high. Conduras did get a hand on it, and he's able to make something of it and get six yards. Six and seven, actually. Nice recovery by Colin Duras. Redding breaks the huddle, second and three. There's the snap, the handoff to uh, Brendan De Silva. He's following his blockers. He's got BJ and Dan out there, Christian Trauger. He keeps his feet, moves all the way down to the 34 yard, yard line. A huge pickup on that play. Great play by the Rockets. Way to be patient by Brendan De Silva following his blockers. You appreciate a play when uh, your, your downfield blocking is, you know, people are holding their blocks and that's what we're seeing here today. There's the snap, the handoff, the bend into Silva. A huge hole opens up, and he's able to grab nine yards for being tackled out by number 44 from Chelsea, the linebacker. But good first down gain of nine. Brendan breaks the huddle, second and two from the 26-yard uh, line of Chelsea. Straight ahead run here. The hole opens up. Colin Duras busts through for 10 yards and a first down, down to the 16, 17 yard line of Chelsea. So big holes are being opened up by that Reading offensive line. Got Chris Julie down there at center. Ben Mason, BJ Gemilaro at guard. There's the snap, the handoff to Brennan De Silva. He follows an army of blockers all the way in for a touchdown. Boy, the blocking on that drive was fantastic. They ran, marched right down the field, and it's 12 0 Reading. So here we go for a second attempt at an extra point. Christian Trauger, number 43. There's the snap, the hold, it's up. And it is wide to the right this time. It definitely had the distance and the height. So it's 12-0 Reading as they work out the kinks here in game one. Here's the kick. Christian Trauger scoops down the left-hand side. Redding's going to get there. Redding has the ball on the onside kick. That was Dan McGrath, I believe, number 12, coming up with it on the 41. Redding ball. You've got to be ready for those squib kicks. 
So Reading comes out again after just marching down on Chelsea for a score. They've got the ball again. That tired Chelsea defense. There's a hole up the middle. B.J. Gemilaro picks up five on first down, down to the 36. De Silva rotates in at quarterback. Split out wide is Matt Hammond to the left. And B.J. goes that way, finds a nice hole, makes a cut, and he's on his way. He's got a first down, down to the 22, 23 yard line of Chelsea. First and 10 for the Rockets now from the 22 yard line. Silva and DeRoss in the backfield. DeRoss takes the snap, bur bursts up the middle, breaks an arm tackle and gets through for a touchdown. Right now the Chelsea linebackers are catching. They're, they're trying to grab guys with their arms. They're not getting low and making the tackles. And Rockets are bursting right through those, those tackles. So now that's three different guys have scored. McGrath on the reception, De Silva on the long run, and now DeRoss. 18-0 Redding. Here we go, Redding, for the third attempt for an extra point. I fear I've jinxed Christian Trotter. There's the kick. It's up, and that one is through. There we go. So two points for Redding there. Brings it to 20 to nothing. Here we go for the kickoff from the 40. The last one was an onside kick that was recovered by the Rockets. Christian gives it a boot this time. Down to the 30, it, down to the 25. He picks it up, he heads to his left, makes a move, and gets down to the 36 yard line where he's brought down by Dan McGrath and number 65, uh, Trevor Zupan. Trevor is there on the team that actually is uh, here uh, in from Wakefield this year as Wakefield couldn't field an A team. So it's great that he gets to play with us as well. First and 10 for Chelsea as they break the huddle. They need to get up to the line quicker. There's the snap, number eight, looking downfield. He's got to throw it. It's a wobbler, and it does not get to the wide receiver. Evan Long on the coverage. Badly underthrown there. Second down. Second and 10 for Chelsea. Got good football weather here today, overcast in the 50s. The rain has let up. Oh, the pitch to the left, and he's uh, finding a little bit of space. Conroy closes on him, brings him down at the 45-yard line, just short of the first down. We'll see where the spot is. Good recovery by Conroy. Yeah, so that's going to bring up third and about a half a yard, maybe a yard. Deep ball, no one home. Number 84 had broken free, BJ was in coverage. The throw went to the middle, 84 went to the outside. On that last play, for some reason they, yes, it's fourth down and one. They had moved the sticks inadvertently. They, they were not at a first down yet. Redding stick screw was uh, giving him a first down. You know, guys, fourth and one here from the 45. Big play for Chelsea to stay in this game. There's a snap eight. Eight takes it himself, breaks to the outside. He's caught and does not get there. Boy, it looked like he was he had a lane, but he's brought down by Brendan De Silva with help from Evan Long. First down, Redding Rockets here late in the second uh, quarter. All 
All right, we have a two-minute warning here. Uh, it's a uh, first down for Chelsea somehow. I guess they gave him a first down on that play. First and 10 of the 46. There's the throw. Number three's wide open. He does not bring it in. No one was home for the Rockets on the left side. And he was wide open, but they could not connect. Chelsea's going to look back at that one and realize they missed an opportunity. Second and 10. Here we go, second and 10. That one appears covered now for the Rockets. There we go. It's a swing pass out to the right side. That should be a live ball. They're calling it an incomplete. I feel like that was a backward lateral. Everybody's in the first game mode today. I think the, the sticks crews, the uh, umpires, maybe even the uh, broadcasting crew. It's, it's the game one of the year. We're all working into game shape. So we're at the 46 yard line. Third and 10 as Chelsea breaks the huddle. Number three split out left. Reading with a size advantage on the line here. Guy breaks through up the middle, is able to pick up six yards on third down, maybe five. Bringing up fourth and four. Here we go, some of those guys in the middle of the line right now, Thomas Keen, uh, Dom DiCrescenzo. We've got Ben Mason up back up in there. Fourth and four, one of the receivers started early. There's a, oh, he's brought down for a sack, number 65. Just burst through the line. That's uh, Trevor Zupan comes up with a big sack to uh, end Chelsea's possession. First and 10 Rockets on the Chelsea side of the field here. Two minutes left here in the first half uh, with a 20 to nothing lead. The ball on the Chelsea 44 yard line. Brendan De Silva's in on quarterback, at quarterback. We haven't seen it yet today, but he has a very strong throwing arm. Redding splits receivers out to uh, spread left, spread right. We've got Jack Blumenshine out there at 73. Wide left, Christian Trauger 43. He's back to throw. He sees Colin Duras open down the right-hand side. Can't bring it in. A great throw by Brendan De Silva. That was about down to the 20-yard line. Uh, the, the, they did crossing routes on both the left and the right-hand side. Colin had started from the slot and was running a post to the outside there. Second and 10. Here's the snap. There's the throw. Broken up by Evan Long, actually. Uh, the defender was in good position to make that play. Third and 10. It's fun to see the Rockets try and throw the ball a little bit here. The running game has been very effective today. They don't, the passing is more of a luxury. Third and 10 Rockets. Will they keep to the air? De Silva on the keeper. He faked the, the throw and he he's, runs up into the line, gets about four yards down to the 40 yard line. That'll bring up a fourth down. Fourth and six for the Reading Rockets now here late in the first half. Still in that spread formation. Dan McGrath goes up to a wing. And uh, setting up the screen pass. Brennan throws away. Dan was uh, covered. That play was designed to go to Dan McGrath on a screen. He just was not open as there was really no pressure on Brendan. And uh, either they smelled it or uh, they just didn't pursue him very difficult. So, That'll be nearly the end of the first half. I think uh, 
Yep, both both sides are going back to their respective uh, sides here to talk to their coaching staffs. Some good things here today. Definitely the, the blocking has been very tough for Redding. The running has been, they found large uh, gaps to run through. Uh, they've put up 20 points in the first half here against a Chelsea team that looks a little deflated right now. So we'll see if uh, the second half breaks. Here we are getting started with the second half now. Reading Rockets will be kicking to Chelsea. Up 20 to nothing. Chelsea has 10 players on right now for the kickoff routine. There we go, number 60 hops on just in time. Both coaches have uh, pumped up their teams here. See if Chelsea made any adjustments. Here's the kick from Christian Trauger. He boots it up deep to the 25 yard line. Fielded cleanly. Makes a move. Breaks through the middle and is brought down at about the 38 yard line by uh, Brennan De Silva, number 10. Chelsea takes over at the, their own 39 yard line. First and 10 for Chelsea. See our first look at Jared Panucci, number eight in the B gap. And he's looking to throw it deep, chucks it up there. The coverage is by Jason Conroy is good. And it did not have a chance of being completed there. Second down. Got the running back really deep. Little bubble screen over to the side, brought down for a loss of three yards on that one. Looks like he's brought down by, uh, can't see the number just yet. Looks like Brendan De Silva. So third down and, uh, and 12 at, at least. There's the snap, the shotgun, number eight. Chucks it up deep. And it is, oh, almost completed. He could not hang on. Coverage out there by uh, Matt Hammond. He had his hand up all the way. Did not have his head around, but did not interfere. So that brings up fourth down and 12. I think we're gonna see Chelsea's first attempt at a punt here, fourth and 12. Brendan De Silva's back to receive it. Oh, it's a good boot. Brendan's got it at the 35. He's got blockers in front of him, Dan. He spins away from one and gets out of bounds in the Chelsea side at about the 48 yard line. So he picked up on the return, a good uh, 15, 17 yards there. Redding will take over. First and 10. BJ's in the backfield with Colin Duross. Matt Hammond split out wide right. Blumenshine at wing back. There we go, BJ burst through a big hole on the right hand side, he is gone. Touchdown, Reading Rockets makes it 26 nothing. Could have drove a Mack truck through that hole. Redding lines up for the extra point. That's four different Rockets to score touchdowns today. 
Snap from, oh, the snap goes, there we go. Christian Trager picks it up on the bad snap. He's brought down at the 12-yard line by number 22 on Chelsea. So no conversion there, makes it 26-0 Redding. Ready to kick off to Chelsea, going left to right. Here's the kick, booted down in the middle, fielded on a hop at the 25. And he's drilled by B.J. Gemoraro. Tried to make a move. B.J. just hammered him at the 30-yard line. As the game goes on, the game goes on, you start to see these Chelsea players get a little more timid from the hits that they've been absorbing today from the Rockets. Here we go. Oh, Chelsea jumped. False start. He did not get the snap count. So now it's uh, first and 15. I like the red socks on Matt Hammond and BJ Gemolaro. Colin Duross with the red towel. Some good style on this Rockets team. Here we go, first and 15 now. In the shotgun for Chelsea. There's a snap, it's over his head. Being pursued and brought down by uh, Zupan at about the 15 yard line. Going backwards here for Chelsea, all the way back to the 15. All those, it really, the importance of the center with a good snap is, uh, is key. Getting it right back to the, look at that little pop up. The quarterback has no time to throw. He's brought down immediately. The sack there by, uh, it was either Zupan or was that uh, number nine, Evan Long? It was one of those two. At any rate, it's third and forever for Chelsea. It's uh, 31 yards, I think. Here we go, third and 32 for Chelsea in the shotgun. Got to play prevent. Do not let him get, get behind you. There's the snap. Pursue, he throws it up. It's a free ball. And he, it's caught at the uh, 18. Jack Blumenshine in coverage. We'll see what the flag is here. They whistled a uh, pass interference on Jack Blumenshine, number 73. So that gives him a first down at the 17-yard uh, line. There's the snap, the pass. Over his head, number 84. Second down. Second down here, Dom DiCrescenzo, middle linebacker right now. Number 22 jumped for Chelsea. They're gonna go back five. That's the second or third time today he's jumped. Gotta keep your eye on that snap. Second or 15. There's a snap. He's going out to the right hand side. He's got a sweep. He's got a lane. Being chased. He could go. He is uh, slowed up enough. Number eight is able to make the tackle. Jared Panucci way downfield. First big positive play for Chelsea in quite some time. First and 10. Oh no, there's a flag on the field at the 30. It appears that we have, is it a holding call? 
nullifying that long run by Chelsea. that 40-yard uh, run for Chelsea. It's uh, going to be second and six. There's a timeout on the field. Second and six for Chelsea now. Back deep in their own territory at the 22-yard uh, line. There's a snap. Here he comes. No, speedy number 20 breaking out to the left hand side on the sweep. He's got some room. He's brought down by Ben Mason across midfield at the 45 yard line. Where were these sweeps earlier for Chelsea? They're, they're getting to the outside right now. They've got some fast ball carriers if they can get out there. First and 10 for Chelsea now. 45 yard line deep in the third quarter here. Speedy number 20 in the backfield. There's the pass, it's up deep. It's underthrown, Matt Hammond in the coverage down at the 30 yard line. Chelsea breaks the huddle now, second and 10. Redding all jammed up on the line here. There's the pass. Oh, I'm sorry, the snap. He's brought down quickly at the 45 yard line. No gain on the play. Brought down by Chris Chuli and Jack Blumenshine, 84 and 73. Right now in the middle linebacker, we get number 32, Dom DiCrescenzo. Third and 10. Looks like Chelsea may have had 12 people in that huddle. Matt Hammond's got the uh, wide back out wide here to the left. There's the snap, the pass, number eight, chucks it up. Terry's running under it, he's got it, he's gone. Touchdown for Chelsea. They've been trying that deep pass all day. They were finally able to connect on one. Beautifully thrown ball, number 10, ran right underneath it and caught it for the touchdown. You know, Adam, when, uh, when you're up close and press coverage like that as a defensive back, you really got to make sure you get your hands on them and, and jam them at the line. Um, there was no cushion for Matt Hammond there, and uh, he ran right, back, right past him, which is going to happen. All right, let's see what uh, Chelsea does for an extra point. Looks like they're, uh, they're going for the one. Twenty-six to six right now. Number eight at quarterback, he just threw the touchdown. He's gonna try and run up the middle. He's dragged down without getting there. Nice play by, uh, I think that was Jason Conroy, number 44. So, 26 to six. It's the Rockets turn here when we come back. All right, 26 to six, Chelsea will kick off from the 40. Brady's got six in the front line. They're ready for anything here. Could it be an onside? It's booted a squib down the, the middle. It gets between BJ and, and Brendan. Brendan picks it up at the 10. He's looking for a lane on the left-hand side. It's a crack block by Dan McGrath. He gets down to the 34 yard line, lowers his shoulder and is able to get a good uh, pickup out of it, but definitely a good kick by that uh, Chelsea guy. As we start the fourth quarter, Redding ball at the 35 yard line, their own 35 yard line, first and 10. We've got two receivers split out left and right. Brennan De Silva as quarterback. Dan McGrath motions to the wing. 
Colin DeRoss motions the direct snap. He gets around the end and he gets outside for a first down and uh, off the late hit, not called by the refs there. He's just going to counsel number 84. Uh, but at nine yards, on, actually, they give him 10 yards on that carry by Colin DuRoss for the first down. Good first down carry. But he breaks the huddle. Same formation as before. First and 10 now, 45 yard line. Evan Long in motion. The handoff to Evan, the same play the other direction. He breaks through one tackle, makes a move, breaks another tackle. He's down to the 24, 23 yard line. Big pickup for Evan Long on that carry. Arm tackles are not gonna do it today. Reading Rockets on the march. Rockets ball, first and 10. Dan McGrath in the backfield now with uh, Brennan De Silva. Here's a snap, the fake to Colin. Brennan takes it himself, moves to the outside, breaks one tackle. He's on his way for the touchdown. Great late block for Dan McGrath, got his head in front. Touchdown, Reading Rockets. That'll make it 32 to six. You gotta be careful of those downfield blocks that uh, you don't block in the back. So for Dan to get his head across in front, Help spray. I don't know if the guy was going to catch Brennan anyway, but uh, but it definitely helped downfield. Christian Chauger for the extra point. Now here's the snap. The kick is up, and it has oh, just short. He got it up in the air, and it was the right direction. It just landed just short. So 32 to six, Reading. Reading ready for the kick. And it's booted, it's squibbed along the left hand side. Number 60 gets it, he drops the ball. And number 12, Dan McGrath picks it up. That was a huge hit by B.J. Gemolaro, actually on the blocker, but he clipped the ball coming out of 60's hands and Redding gets the ball. Jared Panucci calling the uh, plays in the uh, in the huddle this time. A couple guys on the line: Zach Barbo, number 70; Lucas Lorenza, 24. There's a snap to Jared. He takes it around the right hand side. There's a big hole. He busts through and he peels it off to the left. One guy chasing him. A great play by Chelsea to strip the ball away, and they recover in the end zone. Wow, the strip tackle by number 10 from Chelsea saved the touchdown. Nice long run by Jared Panucci. Everything went right there until the very end. Two minutes remaining in the game here. Uh, Chelsea gets the ball at the 20-yard line. You know, Adam, that was a great play by the Chelsea player. Very heads up to strip the ball as he's chasing from behind. So Chelsea gets one last chance to come out on offense, see what they can do here. Got Chris Truly on the left end right now. Colin Duros on the right end. A gap, we've got Lucas Lorenza and uh, Thomas Keane. B gap, we've got Ben Mason and uh, Dom DiCrescenzo. The ball's on the ground, a bad snap. Chelsea covers it up, but Ben Mason was there in case he didn't get it. Second down. 12 yards. There's a snap, number eight. He's got a good arm, we've seen it already. He gets dragged down for a sack by DiCrescenzo, number 32. Third and long now for uh, Chelsea from their 15.
There's a the snap. He's going deep. He's got a man. Oh, he could not hold on. Broken up by Evan Long, who was step for step with number 22 here on the right side. The ball was in 22's hands, but uh, Evan was able to break it up, bringing up fourth down. Fourth down, Chelsea comes out and they spread five receivers. Number eight's got a good arm, bad toss. And he's trying to avoid the sack. Number 65's all over him, Zupan. Help polished off by number 24, Lucas Lorenza. A great sack, a great defensive effort by the Reading Rockets there today. They'll take over. All right. So there's the ball game, the final score, 32 to six, 32 to six Reading Rockets. Four different Rockets scored here today. It was a good team effort. We saw good blocking, good tackling all around. Some things for the coaches to work on and uh, they know what they need to do as they face uh, tougher competition throughout the rest of the schedule. But uh, um, a good start to the season for uh, the Reading Pop Warner A team. Thank you to uh, Adam Hooker for uh, the photogra photography today, and we look forward to being with you next week.